I just picked up a pair of some shoes. I'm sure you guys are probably wondering which pair of sneakers I grabbed. I'm now on my way to Supreme. I'm gonna go see what we can snag there. Hey everyone, what is up and welcome back to my channel, Shay TV. My name is Marissa Hill. If you're new to my channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button as well as give this video a thumbs up at the end if you enjoyed it. And feel free to leave me any comments or questions that you guys may have on my pickups for Supreme Week 8. And don't forget to hit that notification bell as we do have a ton of videos coming out this week that I do not want you guys to miss. So let's get into this. Let's talk about all the items that I was able to pick up in store, talk about how I did online this morning. Let me know in the comments as well, you guys, how you did or if you just passed this week or if you took a fat out. Uh, other than that, let's start with one of my first pickups. So this is the Black Art Cruiser Skate Deck and I got it in the black colorway. It says world famous with that Supreme box logo on the front. And then of course we've got that black arc print going on back there and that nice handwriting. So I'm pretty excited about this. I haven't gotten a deck like this before from Supreme. So I'm so excited to add a new addition to my skate decks that I have. Hopefully I can put some wheels on this soon and I can show you guys a couple skate videos. We'll see see how it goes. Uh, so for those of you who don't know, this deck went for $54 and it also came in a bright yellow colorway, but I just wasn't so sure on that bright yellow. So I just kind of stuck with the classic black coloring scheme. All right. So next up, another accessory. So I got this multicolored pipe skate key. Pretty cool coloring scheme. I'm pretty stoked about how psychedelic it looks. Let's actually see if we can take this out. It's actually quite heavy. And they do give you like this nice kind of foam padding that goes with it, but look how dope the Supreme looks on there. And we got the Supreme New York City on the back. Three eighths, one half. And this also came in a couple other color options. So it came in red and black as well, but I kind of wanted to be a little different this time around and go with more of a crazy kind of coloring scheme. I do like the packaging for this. It's nice uh, and compact, which is pretty cool. And this went for $38. I know I said that I was going to put some stuff together with one of my decks, but unfortunately I don't have all the gear ready to go. And I've got to do something after this video, which is go and send in money to pay my taxes. I'm a procrastinator. Don't know about you guys, but I got to get to the post office before eight o'clock and there's only one post office near me that stays open that late. So I'm going to peace out as soon as this video is done. Uh, next up, let's talk about some of the clothing items. Actually, before we talk about the clothing items, this was not on the drop list, but this is definitely an up and coming brand called Sky High Farms. I've already done a video on this brand in one of my lookbooks. So uh, for those of you who do not know anything about this designer, they uh, it's the son actually of this farm and he is pretty artistic. He's great with designing. This is kind of his theme. He does like moons and strawberries. And what I love about the brand is that they give back 100% of their proceeds to basically increasing the amount of food they're able to produce on their farms. And all of the food that they produce on their farms, they actually give that food back to those in need. So I'm talking, they go to New York and they provide kitchens with food, food banks with food, anything basically necessary for those in need of nourishment. And I just think it's so cool for a brand to literally be so creative with a concept. And of course, they did a collab with Supreme and this is their first collab. But just so you guys know, I love this brand before they did a collab with Supreme. 
so it's so fitting that they did this beanie and I was so happy I was able to get this today because uh, I'm a huge fan of this brand and I think you guys should check them out because it is just a brand that is really not about themselves. I mean, they are all about giving back 100%. They're not trying to make profit off of their items as well as my favorite t-shirt. It's a vintage t-shirt, so they actually do vintage t-shirts where they put designs on top of these uh, vintage shirts that have already been used, which is pretty cool. All right, so now let's get into the clothing section and talk about the three pieces that I was able to cop. First up, what I'm wearing right now, you guys see this is my favorite new fleece, oh my gosh. This is the reversible color blocked fleece jacket. And the thing I love most about this is that you can flip this around and it can be just a simple plain black kind of satiny color scheme and uh, it's got a zipper and buttons so you're definitely going to stay warm it's got Gore-Tex on it so that's insane this is definitely a fleece that's made for the winter time and it's something that's necessary for us <laughs> all of us in New York <laughs> it gets so cold out here so if you haven't been here in the winter time you will understand that layering is essential and this is definitely a great layering piece this came in two color options, so it was two color blocking schemes. Uh, this was kind of my go-to coloring scheme that I liked the most, uh, but there was another option in like a purple, brown, gray kind of coloring scheme as well. Uh, and also we've got lots of pull tabs and just pockets all around this, which is great. So definitely happy and stoked about this coat and the pockets are actually on each side of the, the jacket as well so when you flip it over we've got this supreme here you can see that logo and the buttons and the zipper reverse as well so kudos to you guys supreme i really like this and i do love the supreme uh logos here on the side as well as the front and we've got some logoing going there on the arm cuff and it's very soft it's very soft this is like some sturdy fleece i'm not gonna lie it's not like cheap at all this is definitely quality fleece that they used on this coat Alright guys, so next up we've got the Supreme down half zip hooded pullover. Oh, I did forget to mention, this was 238 and this micro down half zip hooded pullover is $38 as well. I managed to get that in black. As far as sizing goes, that was in a small, this pullover as well, or sorry, this fleece was in a small and the pullover was in a small as well. Typically I get my hoodies in size medium, but when it comes to the jackets, they tend to be a little too big on me, so that's why I decided to go with a small on both the pullover and the fleece jacket. Uh, as far as this micro down half zipped hooded pullover, um, 
it's going to save me this winter what can i say it definitely is extremely light it's got so many pockets all over it we've got a middle pocket to put like your hands in the middle or your gloves or a phone in that compartment section then we've got pockets on the side there's pull tabs on each side so you can keep the air from coming underneath you and i will say the killer in new york it's not even just the cold it's literally the brutal gust of wind that hit you and literally knocked the air out of you it's intense uh so excited to have those pull tabs seems minuscule but it literally could save your life here and the hood as well we've got a pull tab on the back which is insane because one of the issues i always have in the winter time is my hood consistently flies off of my head and with this it actually has a pull tab to keep it tight so that it doesn't go all the way flying off your forehead which is the worst feeling when your ears are freezing because i have tiny little ears and they get so cold in the winter time so definitely need that hood to keep them warm All right, last but not least, we have the Drop Shadow Hooded Sweatshirt. I managed to cop that in the pink colorway. So out of all the colors, uh, I definitely just wanted to get a pink option. I don't really have too much pink in my wardrobe, so wanted to add a different kind of coloring scheme there. This has the Supreme in like a red, a yellow, as well as a green coloring scheme. And I think it really works just quite well with that pink. You know, it's a little different, but um, definitely a little uh, bubble gumish kind of Pepto Bismol pink as well. So it definitely pops. I know I told you guys I was gonna go for the Supreme Nike Air Max Pluses, but I decided to opt out of it because they didn't release the white one, which honestly is the color whether they really want. So uh, definitely gonna have to hold on and wait for that one to release. That Drop Shadow hoodie also went for $158 for those of you who don't know the pricing on that. Uh, other than that, guys, we're going to go through real quick the sell at times and then talk a little bit about resale and how a few of these items are doing. All right, so U.S. sell at times, the first item to go was the LSD Spells hooded sweatshirt in a small, and that went in 7.7 seconds. Next up, the reversible color blocked fleece in this colorway. It sold out fastest in an XL in a small and that was 7.9 seconds for that XL, 8.4 seconds in the small. Then the reversible color blocked fleece jacket went uh, in 9.5 seconds in the small, then an XL, followed by the Supreme Nike Air Max Plus black and pink 
shoes in a size six that went 11.3 seconds followed by a medium in this coat then again the supreme nike air max plus black and pink in a size 6.5 that went in 12.7 seconds uh, followed by the micro down half sip pullover with the woods theme going on there in 14.9 seconds then a small in that same coat went after that uh so yeah those are the fastest selling out items so definitely this fleece was one of the go-to items today next up i would say it was the lsd spells hooded sweatshirt followed by the supreme nike air max plus shoes so let me know if you guys were able to cop any of these items this week uh, other than that, we're going to conclude real quick with how these items are doing on the resale market. So let's go through the resale. Currently, this fleece is going for around $345 and up. The micro down half zip pullover is going in the black colorway around $300 and up. But I will say the most profitable item is not was not on this drop list. It's actually this beanie pickup that I got guys. So this was $40 retail and it's currently going for around $135 to $200. So go sky high. Excited for you guys. All right, so let's just talk quickly about how I did online this morning. I was able to cop a micro down half zip in a small in the black colorway. So got another one that's coming. Wasn't sure if that was going to get confirmed or not, but it did. So looking forward to seeing that. Other than that, you guys, thank you again for tuning into Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up at the end if you enjoyed it. Feel free to leave me any comments or questions about sizing that you guys may have on any of the items that I got today, as well as don't forget to hit that notification bell as we do have a ton of up and coming videos to show you guys. All right, until next time, we will see you on the next video.